Alright guys, welcome back. And you know where we're going from here. We're uh, going down this nice, fine ladder first. It's always a good start. Good warm up. Gotta limber up. Gotta limber up. I just said that. Jerk. I, I know, I know you said it. I was agreeing with you. Let's read the sign. Haunted Wasteland. If you chase a mirage, the desert will swallow you. Literally. Only the path is true. Only the one path is true. Well, let's enter. Sounds safe enough. That sounds pleasant. Alrighty, so... Quicksand. We can't walk across it. But we can use our hookshot. Because someone conveniently put foxes out here for some weird reason. Alright, so the next thing you gotta do is follow the flags. This can be actually challenging sometimes. This is so freaking dusty. This is actually a shop. All those reckless enough to venture into the desert, please drop by our shop. It's like, what? <laughs> carpet merchant. Haha. <laughs> I believe you can buy bomb shoes and stuff from him. He's on a magic carpet, and you might need the uh, hover boots to get to him. I think. I could be wrong. But yeah, it's like, dude, I'm pretty sure you can pick a better place than the haunted wasteland. I mean, who's going to venture into this horrible desert storm just to buy some bombs? Alright, there's the next flag. Um, there. Alright, so now we're going to enter the next trial. Let's go down here. And we jump. Yeah. And then we get ourselves a Skulltula. Bomb diggity. Yay! Da, da, da. All right, and we're gonna need Din's fire. Yeah, and we get ourselves a chest. A chest with most likely rupees in it. Yup, fifty rupees. What a waste. Big ass ruby. Yeah, I think that's the one that's on uh, on top of the Gerudo prison. That's probably a 50. There's a fairy. Yay. And magic. Alrighty. Now let's venture up this ladder, which, for some reason, the dust storm will kind of magically start, you know, blowing midway. Yeah, there we are. <laughs> that's funny. Alright, we're going to need our lens of truth for this next part. Good old lens of truth. Good old lensy. Okay. Okay. Alrighty. Sign here. One with the eye of truth shall be guided to the spirit temple by any inviting ghosts. Oh, well, let's use our lens of truth. Ugh. I'll be your guide on your way, but coming back, I won't play. I'll show you the only way to go, so follow me and don't be slow. What are you, a witch? I guess you could be. Quite possibly. But I like you, though. You're a cool Poe. All the other ones just say, Hey, I'm going to throw fire on you. Because I'm a jerk. But not you. Yeah. You're guiding me to where I need to go. Oh, God. But then again, you're making these things. That t well, you're not making them, but you're leading me into danger. But that's what Link is for. He always, you know, goes into the most dangerous places. Yes, and he, he does. doesn't even state a any opinion of it. And for some reason, we have to, like, kind of do a random circle before we actually get to des Desert Colossus. Oh, God. Spirit. There you are. Spirit, are you here? Okay. And then he'll actually lead me to Desert Colossus. Sweetness. Oh, God, they're coming after me. Alrighty. Alrighty. as we enter awesome cool place that was pretty cool That's really spirit temple thing. is my favorite temple in ocarina of time oh god i'm sinking in sand ah ah all right so i forget if you just stand still we'll eventually just sink all the way in i think i think you might sink all the way in i've never tried it. God, I hate all these these desert things. I forget what they're called. Stupid. Levers. Oh. Okay. No, no, no. Get. There we go. And vultures. 
Ah! Must seek shelter. Ah! Alrighty, haha. Uh, they can't go through rock. Ha ha ha. Sucker. Oh. The spirit temple. Ah, yes. It's in the pots. Magic. Hearts and magic. And bombs. Cool stuff, cool stuff. Alright, so when you enter in here, there's not much that you're going to be able to do. Except for open this and uh, get some bomb shoes. Bomb shoe. You can't go through there, and you can't go through there. That desires you to be a kid. So that tells you something instantly that we have to do something here as a kid. And let's see what these say. If you want to proceed to the past, you should return here with the pure heart of a child. Ha ah, ah. ha. Exactly. Does the other one say something different? If you want to travel to the future, you should return here with the power of silver from the past. Ah, the power of silver. We will soon find out what that is and what that means. But we get ourselves a cutscene. Yay! Oh, is Dyke gonna come get you? <laughs> yep. That's right. Past, present, future. The Master Sword is a ship with which you can sail upstream. It's like that vulture comes down that's back in there. <laughs> <laughs> oh god! <laughs> through Time's r River. The port for the for that ship is in the Temple of Time. To restore the Desert Colossus and enter the Spirit Temple, you must travel back through Time's Flow. Listen to this Requiem of Spirit. This melody will lead a child back to the desert. All of your songs lead me anywhere I want. You're very artsy, aren't you, Sheik? <laughs> <laughs> oh god, he's reading poetry <laughs> This is this is another song I like. I like it's the Shadow Temple and Spirit Temple ones that I probably like the most, and uh, Serenade of Water. Serenade of Water is really good too. Hey, Owl! I can twist my head. <laughs> uh, I'm trying to remember his name. It's escaping me. The giant effing Owl. No, he actually does have a name. It's not stated in the game, for some reason. You have learned the Requiem of Spirit. And Yay. also, the owl has been alive for like s seven more years, too. You just walk up and slap him. <laughs> <laughs> hey, he didn't flashbang for once. He used the sand. He's like, okay, instead of using blinding light, I'm not gonna you throw a bunch of sand in your eyes. Why? Yep. Okay, so we know what that means. We gotta return. To the Is that Temple a of Time. Master Sword pedestal over there. That's uh, that's where I can sing the song and return here. Yay! All right. So this means that we're gonna return as a kid to the Spirit Temple. Because apparently that's what we gotta do. Mm -hmm. That's what we got to do. I like how when every time you teleport to the Temple of Time, you're always facing the exit. Like, all right, you're here. Get out. <laughs> get the hell out. I don't want to leave. I just wanted to give you your sword back. <laughs> he stabs the sword in there, and it takes him, like, a hundred years into the future. Uh, what? <laughs> yeah. All it does is take you in forward in time. You can't go back. You can't go back. So every time you take it out and put it back in... <laughs> <laughs> it takes you farther forward. That'd be funny. I think I forgot the song already. Good one. I like the song, but it's it escapes me. It's pretty. It's not that hard either. Uh -huh. All right, and we fly. Blah. We fly. <laughs> All right, now we're back here seven years ago. Oh yes, and it's night time. So when you guys join us next time, we will be entering the Spirit Temple as a kid. So we are gonna see you guys next time. Later.